healthy diet is fundamental to a fit and happy dog. So what is the first step on setting your beloved pooch on the road to a healthy diet? Well, joining us live from New York is veteran food editor Stacy Billis with more information. Hi, Stacy. Thank you so much for being here. Hi, thank you for having me. No problem. Look, Stacy, for many of us, our dogs have been by our side, getting us through this last 18 months. So as a dog lover and a cookbook author, what are some of your recommendations for how pet owners can return the favor to our dog and give them a little extra love besides all the belly rubs and extra treats? <laughs> Well, listen, extra treats is where it's at, but you hit the nail on the head. Our pets have been by our side over a rough 18 months. I know I can say that personally. I have a pup named Ziggy, and I'm a cookbook author. I'm a recipe developer. Treats, you can never get enough treats. That's the way it goes. But here's the key if you don't want to overdo it. You want your treats to smell good and you want them to taste good, right? But if they're also filled with nutritious ingredients that nourish you, then it's a win-win. I have a family. I feel this way about feeding my boys. I have an 11-year-old and a 14-year-old, and man, can they eat. Same with my pup, Ziggy. As long as his treats are good for him, then I think he deserves all the treats he wants. <laughs> oh, awesome. I feel that same way, too. And I have two family dogs, uh, Knox and Kane. And sometimes I just want to spoil them and give them all these treats. And everyone else in my family is like, Ashley, stop doing that. <laughs> but I just want them to feel loved and, and give them, you know, the stuff that they like. And so tell me, why do you think what you feed your pet is one of the most important things we can do for them? Listen, it's one of the most important things we can do for all living creatures. You are what you eat. That's what they say, right? So I couldn't be more excited to be partnering with Fruitables Pet Treats because like I said, you do want to be careful about what you're treating them. You want to make sure that it's quality, wholesome ingredients. Fruitables is made with combinations of fruits and vegetables and superfoods. And the number one superfood that I'm excited to talk to you about today, perfect timing, Pumpkin, it's pumpkin season. So pumpkin is great for you, it's great for me, it's also great for our dogs. The health benefits of pumpkin are what inspired the whole Fruitables line, which is why it's an ingredient in so many of their products, and they combine them with other superfoods like apples and blueberries and strawberries, watermelon, peanut butter, Greek yogurt. I mean, just wholesome, good for you ingredients that nourish Ziggy. I love this. So I, I love how you're saying this is combined with things like apples and things like that. How harmful or great is it if I give my dog something like a little apple treat or I drop a strawberry and let Knox <laughs> go to town on it? Is that, am yeah. I hurting my dog by doing that? Listen, it depends. There are some off-limit foods, so you want to be careful. That's why I love Fruitables, because, of course, those wholesome ingredients, when they're the right food for your dog, is great for them. But you want to be careful not to make a mistake. Aw, there's Ziggy eating his little skinny oh, minis. So cute. What Fruitables does <laughs> is it takes those dog-approved ingredients, and you know that you're feeding them something safe and something nourishing, too, and it's good for them. You know that they're going to get that pumpkin, which is great for their digestive health. It's great for weight management, which is really, really important. So that's why I lean on these treats. And also, you know what? I do enough cooking for my boys at home. <laughs> I'm just happy to have a treat that I can grow grab the bag, open it up, and know that I'm giving Ziggy something that's really good for him and that he loves, of course. Thank you so much for being here. We really appreciate it. I'll make them for you sometime. Thank you for having me. Yes, absolutely. I would love that. Guys, I want you to stay right there because we got more Good Day Live when we get back.